Hey everyone, I have one trucking question. What all goes into safety testing when they're building new trucks? Well, you know what's crazy is there's actually no regulation on crash testing for Class 8 trucks. So really, it's totally up to the OEM what it is is that they want to do. Um, but at Volvo, there's so much testing that goes into designing a new truck. And basically, once we've done enough analysis to be confident in our design, we first test just the bare bones, the cab structure itself. Um, this is when we do our Swedish impact test, which is actually kind of the first cab strength test ever be invented back in the 70s. And so this is going to be, you know, about 3,000 pounds coming to the driver's A-pillar, then another 3,000 pounds going to the rear wall, and then finally a roof crush test, really to simulate, you know, the worst case rollover condition. And then in order to pass that test, you have to be able to open the door and have the, enough survivable space in the driver's seat for the 95th percentile male. Um, sticking with just the cab, we're also going to be doing sled tests, which is, you know, dynamic testing, uh, pushing the cab into uh, the different walls, we're going to also be doing seat pull tests to make sure that our seats and our seat belts are going to survive impact. And then once we've done all of that, then we move on to complete vehicle testing. So that's when we crash complete trucks, you know, that are driving into barriers at different speeds, at different heights, different angles. Um, and we'll also do complete rollover tests, too. So, you know, even if there isn't much in the way of regulation, you know, Volvo is always, always going to go above and beyond and make sure that our trucks are going to be there when it matters most. Wow, that is a lot. Thanks for sharing, Madeline. Great to see you.